The new Battle Royale program dropped today, and we have some great players to check out. We got James Paxton. He had a great card last year, and honestly, this looks just about as good. Checking out the pitch mix. He does have cutter. He does have sinker. Pitch control looks good. The sinker pitch control is not good, but the other ones are pretty good. The break on all is good, except the sinker. So that's a little bit troubling that the sinker is his weakest pitch and the sinker is the toughest pitch in the game. That's a pitch you want to be able to throw. So we'll have to see how that works out. But this looks right now like the second or third best lefty in the game, just based on these attributes, but based on playing with them last year. So I'll definitely be going for this card. But this card, man, Giovanni Stan, I know last year his swing was not good. You couldn't get around on fastballs inside from a righty, but they fixed it. His swing is really good this year. And look at these attributes. 125 power from both sides. Of concern is the contact from the right side. I know contact this year is way more important than in past years. I couldn't really hit well with Joey Gallo this year because contact is so low and years past I could hit good with Gallo. So that might be a problem for this card, but most of the pitchers you'll face in ranked seasons are left because we got Al Leiter, now James Paxton, Vita Blue, Cliff Floyd, Tom Glavin, or Alice Chapman. So you're going to be facing lefties more than you are righties. So the lefty contact is more important at this point in the meta. So just remember that. But speed in the outfield is only 63. It's not horrible. You'd prefer to have a Buxton or an Acuna or somebody that's fast out there. So I don't know if he's playable. I'm going to try him because I really love his swing and he's maxed out power. This card could be incredible. I'm definitely going to try him. I want to try both these cards, so I got to get them. I'm going to get one of them and buy the other, but we have a long road. You got to get 100 points. Check out these missions. They nerfed these player missions, and I'm glad they did. You only need three Ks with this Brock card. I'm not sure who that is. You only need two extra base hits with this Calhoun card. Carpenter, one home run. All of them are the same. Two extra base hits, one home run, three Ks. One home run, two extra base hits. These are very doable. You probably only need to draft these guys one time and you'll be able to complete this mission. Before, if you draft them, you might be able to complete the mission, but you might not. You might come up short and then hopefully get to draft them again, but probably won't get to draft them again. So it's kind of, it was kind of hard to do these missions in the last two runs, but they really nerfed them. I'm going to have an auto draft on any of these players. If I see them, I'm drafting them automatically. So that'll help me get through this faster. And then in the last two runs, I did complete the nine game in one run both times. So that gave me a boost. Maybe I'll get the 12 and 0 this time. Who knows? But uh, this will be fun. Let's get into it. Let's get into the game. So he's 55 and 18. So this guy's pretty good. Ah, uh, he got his strikeout. No. Oh, is that down? No, it's not down. No. Good pitching. He might bunt, but I kind of doubt it with that average. It'd probably be a lot higher if he was a bunter. Robinson. Troy Gloss getting it. Troy Gloss again. See if I can get him to chase a slider. Yes, I did. Too close to take. He's gonna leave him in. Nice. Dang. Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm starting to read him a little better. Oh, go, 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 go. That was lucky. And I'm scoring. Nice. Going for the pitcher. Go with the lefty. I guess I only got one option, really. Steven Vogt. Steven Vogt. Good pitch. Jeez. He loves that sinker right here. I'm going to watch for it now. Nope. Too far. 
Yes, he went to it too much. Yes, went to the well one too many times. Oof, I almost got another one. Ah, and a bad ball. Good inning. Made him pay for going to the sinker in like five or six times that inning. Yes. You can use a two-seamer like a sinker, and it's sunk. That's just a tough pitch, righty and righty. Kind of swinging wildly now. He's swinging a few bad pitches outside the zone. I'm going to do a backdoor. Cool. This, this card just must be really tough to hit, because nobody seems to be able to hit him. Nice. I really, he's really swinging at all my pitches. He's not swinging at any good pitches to hit. And um, he's just pressing. Ah. Uh, Glaus does have a little bit of a slow swing. I'm not going to blame him because, I don't know, I should have read that better. Oh, just got under it. Thought that was going to break more. I thought I, I thought I had that. Oh, I got lucky. Right through the gap. All right, Schwarber. Oh, he's, he's smart if he puts in a lefty because... Oh, he didn't? He didn't put in a lefty for Schwarber? What's he doing? Ah, somebody said you can you can really read his pitches, but I haven't been able to do that. Oh, man. He's trying to be patient. And see, that's the thing. You try to be patient, you're going to be late on the fastball. Hitting is precise. Oh. So I know he's trying to be patient, so I'm going to bust him with the fastballs in. Because he's going to have a little bit slower reaction. And we get the no-hitter on a World Series player. All right, good game. Uh, that guy was probably a good player. I mean, 55 and 14 is good. He was World Series. That's good. Uh, I didn't feel like I hit great. I struck out a few times. I did get the clutch hit with Steven Vo Vogt. He did the intentional walk. I had to say, he had a few questionable strategy moves because he could have thrown lefties to Schwarber and to my center fielder, which is my weakness in my lineup. But he didn't. He threw righty. I felt like that was a bad move on his part. But I just was fortunate. But yeah, it's my first game. That was a tough draw for the first game. Usually in the first game, you get you don't get an opponent that's that good. But it's going to happen sometimes. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.